once we uh, get power supply, and then we'll be able to operate a cooling system using seawater. But the Tokyo Electric Power says the pumps were doused with seawater and need to be repaired. The power company plans to use makeshift pumps to connect to the system. Fukushima Prefecture says levels of radiation that require decontamination have not been detected in any of the evacuees from near the nuclear power plant. According to prefectural disaster policy meetings, evacuees are to be screened for radiation whether they were exposed or not. More than 10,000 people were screened on Wednesday. Despite the fact that some had to brush off their clothing and shoes, no one has so far required a total decontamination yet. On the seventh day since the disaster, the power plant is still very unstable, and the prefectural government is having a hard time deciding on policies and effective measures. Well, the number of dead from Friday's massive quake and tsunami has exceeded 5,400. Nearly 9,600 others are still missing. The town's National Police Agency says 5,429 deaths have been confirmed so far, and 9,594 people remain unaccounted for. In Miyagi Prefecture, 3,004 deaths have been confirmed, and more than 2,200 people are missing.